you know, you're right off the presses in 1917. <laughs> um, like, and you can't have you know, had much turnaround between the you know the two films. Like, what what was it like to, to play such a drastically different character from, in, in a, such a drastically different film? In, in all honesty, it, Ned came first. Ned, really? I, we filmed True History of the Kelly Gang, and I auditioned for 1917 just when I got home. Right. For 1917, and it's just because the process of editing mm. with with Ned, it took it was a much longer edit. And then also because it didn't have a release date set, because yeah. it's an independent film, mm -hmm. they then had to get it into festivals, and then once it got into festivals, then it got distribution, and now it's coming out. Whereas 1917, because it had it had a release date before we began filming, yeah. oh. we were always sort of streamlined into mm -hmm. that that period of time. And also because it's we filmed it broadly chronologically and uh -huh. the nature of those long takes, we rehearsed it for months, but actually we sort of had a rough cut the, very, yeah. the final day of shooting. So it's really interesting, it's like watching both side by side, they're such different films, you know, they've got so, yeah. so many different things to say. Uh, yeah. you know, it's really, it must have been hard to, to transition though. Yeah, it, it was, but to be honest, it, sorry, like doing, <laughs> doing, um, uh, doing Ned taught me a huge amount about Schofield. Like when, uh -huh. because cause the Kelly Gang is quite a intense film. During the last sort of few weeks of it, I remember being so kind of emotionally and physically mm -hmm. exhausted, I remember kind of, I remember thinking without sounding too sort of doom and gloom, I, I don't have, if I, if I step outside of this, mm -hmm. I'm gonna sort of fall apart. So I can, wow. I can only, I can only do this, I can do this, no bother, that's fine. But if you ask me about home, if you ask which is where I wanna go at the minute, yeah. if we talk about it, I can't do it. Mm -hmm. And I don't want to not be able to carry on. And that's, so I was feeling that, and then about a month later I auditioned for Schofield, and uh -huh. there wasn't a script, but the the first scene that I had to audition with was the scene where Blake's kind of going, tell me about home, tell me about home, tell oh, me about home, right. and he's going, no, don't make me, don't make me, don't make me. <laughs> and I knew that because I knew that feeling.